Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Epic Battle Fantasy IV. So, in the last episode, we made it here into Ashwood Forest, we started up the game, and we realized that having one party member isn't the best thing, so we got another party member, one of the people we're actually chasing down, Matt the Hero, or Meat Shield, or Warrior, or whatever you want to call him. And we start out fighting new enemies. Ah, uh, they're adorable, but they're also in the way. So, Scanbot. Seriously though, I should mention I have a huge love for foxes, and that's why this is going to hurt so badly. So we need water, ice, or poison to kill those. We need fire, electricity, wind, or poison. So with Matt, I think it makes the most sense to attack you with water. Don't you have any remorse attacking a young innocent girl like that? Right, young innocent, sure. And the dog is dead. Taking damage fills up a player's limit bar, shown in red. When it fills, a player can use a powerful attack called a limit break. First casualty, burn, baby burn. It caught itself on fire, so we got a medal for that. Don't ask. Um, let's see, we could revive... I didn't mean to do that. Eh, sure, let's try to revive her. <laughs> Hope there's better things to eat around here than bats, but I shouldn't complain. They still taste better than what I usually eat. And he did a counterattack. By the way, the reason it's healing is because it actually absorbs fire, so by catching itself on fire, it heals itself. And that thing's dead. Wool and fine fur. So, we got red feathers. Collect a bunch of these and you can build a bird, maybe. We got honeycomb and we got kiwi. So, while we do this stuff, uh, beef will increase defense and we all know who the meat shield is. Magic attack, magic defense. I'll decide on that stuff later. I think I should give that to her. Like I said, he's the tank. Alright. Now there's some bats in our way. HP represents your player's life. Click on the player's HP bar to see a full list of their stats and resistances. So you can easily see everything that you need to from in here. Alright. Oh, Burn, stun, freeze, tired, which evade in accuracy decrease every turn. Poison, dispel, cancels all buffs and positive status effects. Stagger, next, take, next hit taken to do a critical hit. Siphon, wet, weak, attack and magic attack decreases every turn. Okay, so it's like tired, but for attack. Curse, defense and magic defense decrease every turn, so it's okay, yeah and Death and Doom. Well, those things are dead. MP are needed to use the most skills. If you ever run out of MP, you'll have to use a healing item or stick to basic attacks. Don't try to blame that one on lag. That was a newbie death. To be fair, that was really unfortunate. Let's revive her again. What I was trying to do, not even death can stop me. I was trying to use this, but apparently they got the first attack. I pray to the great mother nature for support in this battle. I always recycle, so I think I deserve this favor. Yeah, I was trying to do that, but you know, my bad luck and whatnot. Oh, well, I don't belong here. I'll die for sure. It's a good thing that there's an autosave feature just in case I forget to save manually. Oh yeah, I should probably save now. You know, I could. I could not. Which I'm not going to. Wasps were always followed by more wasps, so take them out quickly before the rest show up. Okay, 
Red Wasp, an invasive insect which uses poison attacks and may poison players, may summon more Red Wasps. They are weak to nothing that Matt uses. Ah, wait, light, right. Good. Well, that thing's dead. Wasp mission life is to mess up your day. That's literally all they do. They don't even pollinate flowers. And now their day is messed up because they are dead. <laughs> We got some flare, the flame badge increases fire and burn resistance, as well as beer. Which reminds me. Boost MP. Boost fire and burn resistance. Oh, done. Alright, just try to take you down. Didn't work out for me. But now. Oh, really? My love for swords is giving me the ability to create them from thin air. <laughs> Sadly, it didn't hit the enemy. Really, the second attack, of course, missed. Alright, uh, since they're immune to earth damage, let's just basic attack this one. Less chance of us being hit. Generic weak bat enemy use wing attack. It wasn't very effective. And of course that missed, because it was dead. Why wouldn't it miss? <laughs> Found milk, buffs an ally's magic attack, coffee, and muffin. I love the muffin. Also, in this game, you don't have to be moving around to heal. It just happens with time, which is nice. It makes it so I don't have to run around in circles like an idiot. By the way, you're really strong for surviving the air to the head. I'm impressed. Most people would die from that, unless you don't have a brain. <laughs> nah, that's impossible. That was nothing! I'm a warrior. I could survive anything. Set me free and I'll help you find that thing you were looking for. I don't trust you yet. You and your friends have quite the reputation as troublemakers. Is that so? Well, it's all lies. I've never stolen anything until today. Well, a thief and a liar. Okay, we got sushi, which increases maximum MP by 2%. Tentacles, ew, it's slimy and sticky, as well as soft wood. So, let's see. Element wind, element poison. I'm gonna see what these guys are weak to inside. These idle guys would look a bit more menacing if they weren't only a foot tall. Let's try using wind. Of course. Of course I would miss. Hack, it burns! Okay, um... They're weak to light, wind, water, and ice. They don't care about poison, so I guess I'll just use wind like I was trying to. I just want to keep missing, and yeah, that's fine. There we go. Wow, his accuracy is really lower, and for some reason, she's the one missing. I guess he had to miss at some point, right? There we go, now that one's dead. Basic attack, and just keep missing, sure. It should be mentioned that these guys have a really high evade. As you can tell, they, their evade is 10. There we go, now it's dead. We need water skills, and I happen to have one. Except I didn't realize this battle was about to happen, so, uh... Let's try to heal. That falling ash is burning all the foes too, except they absorb fire damage, so that's not good. So I need magic attack.
you know what? I'm going to be tactical and retreat. Yeah, I know I'm kind of a coward, but you can't always do everything correctly. And it's a good excuse to do that. Another medal. So I guess we should go for medals now. As you can see, we have a lot more ready. First blood, defeat your first foe and become a hardened killer. First casualty, watch a player die as you do nothing to help. Lunch time, take a break and have something to eat outside of battle. Limits were broken, use an awesome limit break for the first time. A slime cat, find a slime cat and discover the warp zone. Burn baby burn, set a phone fire and watch them burn. Even though we didn't do that, they did it themselves. Permanent stat boost, eat a stat boost and a snack and boost your stats permanently. Pro tip, don't give them all to one character. I pretty much have already done that, you can't stop me now, I'm gonna have a good time, I'm having the ball. Zoology student, scan a phone, begin filling in the base jerry. Deforestation problems. Enter Ashwood Forest for the first time. Chicken molester. Seriously stress out a chicken. Just don't stab it. Mm, Zelda. Alright. So, let's try this again. I'd rather not switch down the difficulty if I can avoid it, because I'm not a coward. Alright, one dead. Surprisingly, it didn't try to burn me. Alright. Dang it. Of course you'd miss. And he has his limit break. But his accuracy slowered that. I'm not really sure it's worth it. your cursor over status icons to learn more about them. Some of them are very severe, while others you can usually ignore. Okay. Limit break. So we got the blessed status. Immune to being inflicted with bad status effects including death and dispel. So we now know what that does. And we have a randomly chance we have a random chance of being inflicted with that at any time. Inflicted, quote unquote. As if it isn't a good thing. And we can be burned because of bless, so that's pretty awesome. Ability points, AP, are usually learned to use new skills. AP is earned after battles and can be used in the skills menu. Got gunpowder and red feathers. Speaking of skills, let's check out what we can learn. They ain't nothing good, actually, so we're gonna... Uh, yeah, we're, we're not gonna... We're not gonna mess with that right now. Alright. We're gonna switch players and use his limit break. Swordsman always has an ultimate multi slash attack. That's me. I'm, I'm not gonna be original here. It's probably for the best, actually. Okay. This is a flame spray, a creature that embodies the spirit of fire, it uses fire attacks. It's weak to earth, poison, water, wind, and death. Poison, you say? Earth, you say? Poison, you say? Alright, and we're done. Okay, we got the Eagle Eye. High accuracy bow counters attacks of piercing shot. And we got Iron Ore, which I really wanted. Because now, we can upgrade this. Plus 15 uh, attack and magic attack, which, you know, pretty much doubles his attack currently. It's pretty great. It also gives plus 5 to evasion. So what are Matt's stats looking like? Okay. So he now has an attack of 11. Which, by the way, doesn't give a base increase of 15. It gives a 0.15 increase. So before it was a 0.15 increase, so now it's a 0.3 increase. 
you know, because that's how stats work. Eventually, that'll be a good thing. For now, it's nothing too game-breaking. But with the fact that our stats are so low to begin with. And we have a dead fox now. Time to use Geyser. We have another dead fox. Sadly, this is two waves, and they just keep lowering my accuracy over and over again. Okay, we're done with the first wave, and this is just a bigger version of it. So what level is this thing? Level 7, yikes. That's gonna be some trouble. Or maybe not. Man, I wish I had an ice or a thunder skill right now, then I could show off something pretty cool. Dang it, missed the second one. Earth. Dang it. And it's dead things to poison. Cool. We got beer, buffs and allies attack, red feather, and a magma sample. A bottle sample of molten earth. Level up for everyone. Hey, AP, blah blah blah. Uh we're in this area, so I may as well use a thing to get this. New skill learned. You guys should be able to figure out what that does. So where do your thieving friends run off to then? I don't know, they ditched me because I was carrying too much. Natalie can't run though, so she's probably nearby. Lance is good at hiding, so we won't find him if he doesn't want us to. I see. Well, we need to go this way anyway. There's someone important in the forest that I need to talk to. The force is turning out to be more alive than I thought it would be. Hey, these vines are harmless as long as you don't snag yourself on them. Okay, were they weak to poison? Yes, they were. Cool. Alright, one dead. Really called another one. He gets more experience for us. And this thing is about to be dead. Because it never attacked us. Like, lowering your defense is nice and all, but it only gets you so far. New skill found. We got Bamboo Trap, made poison targets, high accuracy hits five times. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Be even better if I had more, you know, AP to use. Okay, we're gonna... Summon up the scan bot. Alright, a black wasp, level 4. Huge insect which uses poison attacks may summon red wasp and more black wasps. So, poison isn't good on it, light is though, so we're just gonna attack normally. It is weak to wind. All right, one dead. Cool, it was a critical hit. Finally, that second sword actually hit. And kill it with wind. All right. An energy drink, uh, uh, buffs and allies evade, cheese, we already know what that does, and bug wings. So I uh, bet you can tell what that's supposed to be. If you can't, then I feel sorry for you, but it's pretty obvious. Alright, I think that's a good place to stop for today. So let's check our medals. We got a new skill found. Find a new special skill. You can find them in chests or get them from quests. That rhymes, actually. Oh, cool. Alright, did we get anything else? I don't think so. So, guys, next time, well, let's play Epic Battle Fantasy IV. We're nearing the end of this forest, so I think we should be able to be done with this the next episode, if not, then the one after that. I'm remembering a few big fights that happen up in the next few screens, 
So, depending on if I want to do all of them right then and there, it may be two episodes from now. But, you know, these are only like 20, 25 minute episodes to begin with, so it's not like that's like an hour from now or something. It's pretty soon. So guys, I'll see you guys next time.